It's a level two holster from it's a Scorpion Gear Tactical. It looks exactly the same as a lot of the uh, the Chinese holsters that are on Amazon. Uh, this was just happened to be the one that I could find that had a actual belt clip and not just a paddle. So we'll get this open and take a look at it and then see how it actually fits the gun. Inside the package with the uh, holster itself came the paddle holster. Sebastian's joining us. It is the uh, holster still has the paddle and a tool to remove the paddle so that we can put on our belt clip. Alright, so in with the belt clip, there is tool, the actual belt clip itself, and that guy. First thing I'm going to do is use the tool provided with the holster itself uh, to remove this back paddle. Now on it, it's kind of a, not a full leather, it's like almost like a neoprene, uh, sort of like a wetsuit material, what it feels like, uh, around the back of it. Super thick plastic uh, all throughout. This is really well made. Um, let's see if I can... Nope, not loose yet. Let me loosen this so I can show you that it does turn. Now just to show this on the holster itself, I did loosen the screw in the back. Uh, you can actually pivot this to find different Sebastian wants to help. Don't eat that. Go. Dork. Um, you can actually, yeah, if you can actually, if it'll focus, you can see in there there are teeth so that way when you tighten it back down, it will interlock and then hold it secure in whatever position you wanted it. So one thing I just noticed, um, <clears throat> the tool provided with the belt clip does not fit that center screw. Uh, it's made to fit those two that are at the top up there. It's actually a height adjustment to uh, change it to like the width of your belt to have a better fit. And uh, yeah, it only works on the top one, so I'll be using the tool that came with the holster itself to attach that. The actual fit of it. And this is a uh, Taurus G2C. If you want to know the specific model. They also make a G2S. It's a single stack. Same thing, just tiny bit skinnier, I think. Actually, I don't even think it's skinnier. I think it is just a single stack. I don't remember it feeling any more. And also, just a side note, a lot of people hate it. I love that. I love having a spot for my finger to get used to go to whenever I am in a non-firing position for it to rest. That little dent is, I don't know, one of the many reasons I say it's worth buying this, but I need to do a review on this completely by itself. Anyways, fit, snaps right in. Looking down, let's go up here to where we got some light. Okay, you can kind of see some daylight coming through up around the top of the slide, down around the trigger guard. You've got some more over there because this is made to fit more than just one model uh, handgun. But aside from that, the retention is solid. Uh, you, know, I got, you do have a little bit of play there. Try and see if I can. Just that much is the play that's there. The release is very smooth. The paddle is very smooth. Uh, yeah. So that's it. Uh, it's listed as the Scorpion Tactical Gear. I'll put the link in the description. Uh, it will come as the SciTech holster. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it'll come stamped SciTech. 
There's a ton of these on Amazon. Uh, it's just that if you find the one that's listed as Scorpion, is the one that will give you the belt clip. I got it because this is for my job. Uh, I'm a security officer, and I don't want somebody to be able to run by me and grab this and slide this off of me, or be able to get this off of me. It's just basically three extra bucks for uh, peace of mind, more or less. Oh, 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 oh,